it's Pride Month, so we are here to talk to Onir and Vidur. Welcome to Vion, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, Onir, let's start with you. You know, um, you have made a film called uh, My Brother Nikhil, and here you are with Pine Cone. How has people's perception changed over the years? Uh, I feel that when I made My Brother Nikhil, everyone thought it's a very bold film at that time. And uh, now they tell me that it was way ahead of its time and if it's released now, it would have a better reception. And I realize when people watch Pinecone, they say that it's a very bold film, way ahead of its time. And I keep telling that maybe the films are not ahead of its time, people are behind time. And uh, uh, it's they who need to, you know, uh, become more with the times. But uh, what it is like to be uh, from belong to a queer community and be a part of the film industry. I feel that you know in the surface uh, everything is everyone is as accepting as uh, it can be. It's an industry that's in a way very inclusive. No one really cares. Being a part of Pine Cone, you know what was the most important thing for you when you were doing a film like this? Was was there a fear of acceptance? I think the fear was just sort of stepping my footing into finally, you know, this industry and uh, trying to understand what is it uh, over there that is meant for me. But other than that, there was no fear. But Anir, why was it so important for you to have, um, you know, a person who is an actor who represents the queer community? Why was that important? Or was it not? I mean, I want to know what was the process like to get Vidur? On board. I think for a long time I've been wanting to do this, to want to work with queer actors. Ideally I want to do a film where uh, all the queer, queer characters are played by queer actors and I have also a crew which is out and proud queer. But uh, it's difficult because a lot of people still are trying to figure out how to come out. And also I think this process was very organic because as a filmmaker you cannot really ask people their sexuality, it's not ethical. And in, it was always in my head that if someone tells me, it's a plus one, <laughs> you know, in the auditions. And uh, Vidu was kind of shortlisted and we were kind of uh, going through the final uh, selection process while we were, which was also like workshops and yeah, and I was trying to explain to him the intimacy and how that this film is not going to be filtered. Uh, and at one point he says, oh dear, you don't have to struggle so much to explain to me because I belong to the community and I'm out and proud queer. And that really, really, I was like so happy that, uh, you know, one is his journey. For me, this character is very special because it's semi-autobiographical and to have someone who also shares that lived in experience. Of course, each of our experiences are different because we're different human beings, but to be able to understand the core essence of it, you know, it makes life much more easier. Do you think that when you make films like this, being a part of a film, making a film, uh, which is about LGBTQI community, people's perception changed after they watch films like this? Absolutely. I feel that even today, the kind of messages I get about my brother Nikhil, how many people have used the film to come out to their families, uh, shown it across the world and somewhere or the other. I remember when I was screening it in San Francisco, you know, people stood up, they were all cheering and say that it reminded them of the 90s when they lost their friends. So people connected in various, various layers because it's not just about uh, being queer, it's also about their families, about friends, about memories, relationships. Uh, similarly, you know, right after the uh, screening at Kashish as the opening film, I've been getting messages from so many people from the community how they thought that it was a film that was from the queer gaze without being trying, without seeking validation from the heteronormative world and how they could identify with the journeys of the characters and they were all very, very thrilled that the film ended with hope. Thank you so much. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. Thank Abhira. you.